How many of you know the story of Gold Rush, which is taken place in 1848 to 1852 in United States of America? So the location was California. Uh, formerly, California is not a city, not a town, not a state. It is a small, you know, location, rural area. But in 1848, there are the people. Whenever they are digging the land, they find lot of gold. They, th- you know, the message spread all across the world. The people who live nearby California, uh, it is just the message spread rural to towns, towns to the national, national to the international. All the countries who are neighboring countries to the U.S. travel towards California. They started digging the mines. they are you know there are few people find the gold the other people could not find the gold and uh, according to you know the surveys it is shown that 3 lakhs 25000s of 25000 kg of gold found in gold rush so see who will become rich from this gold rush most of the people we feel that you know the person who, who is powerful so whenever uh, if you go to the uh, the person who when go to the gold rush they started digging so if they find the gold they are happy if someone not find the gold if they are powerful they are attacking the weak people and snatching their gold they are be they also happy and uh, we are all feel that the person in the gold rush who is more powerful in the gold rush who is more powerful digging the land they'll be having more gold we we feel that who is the powerful people will become rich from the gold rush you tell me who will become the richest people from gold rush we all feel that the powerful people but that is wrong the person who sold clothes the person who sold shovels shovels which is uh, which will help to dig the land a spade so those people become rich this is what happened in the gold rush same story uh, told by j bezos j bezos told that so i feel the same way he get the idea i feel because of internet is uh, you know he just uh, compare with the internet he spoke uh, he given a speech in ted talks uh, in 2003 in that speech he spoke about 2000 uh, sorry gold rush in 1848 to 1852 so that's where i find this story i researched so what happened who, who how the shovel seller become the rich he, he could not uh, dig the land but he become rich that's where the secret of earning money sometime you no need to become a richest uh, you no need to become an entrepreneur to become rich you no need to start a business if you start a business you no need to have a product so most of the people we all believe that if you want to start a business you need to have a product so look at amazon would they have any own product no they just help someone who is doing the business and they are becoming rich so that's where this amazon they bezos find this idea so we don't have any product through is medium and becoming rich same way if you want to start a business you no need to work on the product you just help someone who is want to who want to start a business you help them and become rich so this is where if you want to start a business your idea should you know mesmerize it has to disturb that uh, society look at elon musk what are his ideas so that's where initially no one believes at you no one you know ev- the people who criticize you it's okay it whichever idea criticized more it is going to work more so what we learn from gold rush the gold rush will tells us no if you want to start a business you no need to have a product even though you can become rich that's the way so the person who sold clothes in gold rush he become rich levi strauss so he is uh, he having a levi brand right the man who became rich from that gold rush Thank you for watching.